Now let's go a step further and hide this and go to the same compression, but with different settings. So this is what we just heard. She's dropping me. I'm a leaf in her broken breeze, trying to clear the tree tops. She's dropping me. I'm a leaf in her broken breeze, trying to clear the tree. I'm going to give you a clue. It's the same compressor, it's the same ratio, and it's the same threshold. What could be different? Option A. She's dropping me. I'm a leaf in her broken breeze, trying to clear the tree tops. She's dropping me. I'm a leaf in her broken breeze. Trying to clear the tree tops. Do you feel the vocal going further back a little bit, not being as present? Let's listen to that second phrase right there with the new settings. I'm a leaf in her broken breeze. I'm a leaf in her broken breeze. One more time, second settings. Listen to I'm a leaf in the broken dreams. I'm a leaf in her broken breeze. I'm a leaf in her broken breeze. You don't hear a drastic difference. What you hear is a different vibe, right? You hear that the second compressor is actually pushing the vocal back quite a bit. Here's a clue. I shorten the attack a lot. So basically the compressor comes in right away and catches the transients. You hear that a lot on mixes where the compressor is on stun, especially if people are using the SSL compressor and they have the fast attack on. Everything pulls back as the more you compress, the faster it gets, the more the transit gets killed, the less presence and texture you have. I'll play it again now that you've seen it, because if you've seen it, you hear it. Check it out. So this is the first setting with a wide open attack at 10 milliseconds. I'm a leaf in her broken breeze, trying to clear the tree tops. I'm a leaf in her broken breeze, trying to clear the tree tops. You hear the difference in presence and grabbing, I would say grabbing that, that texture thing. So the lesson here is that the attack of the compressor is as important as a threshold or the ratio, if you have control over the attack. So when you hear something, either on the radio, Spotify, or a session that somebody sends you that you're gonna work on, when you listen to something, you can tell right away, am I crushing the transients? Am I crushing the transients because the attack is too fast? The first thing to do is to adjust the attack of your compressor if you like how the compressor is doing the level. So you have to train yourself to hear the difference between over compression because of too much compression or over compression because of the attack. And that's the difference.